Hey guys, here is Digiber channel. Forgot the passcode to your iPhone? Entered the wrong passcode multiple times and eventually made it unavailable? Don't panic. The good news is, you can regain access to your unavailable iPhone by resetting it. The bad news? Resetting the device will erase all of its content. If you haven't backed up your data, you'll lose it forever. But if you have, you can easily recover it from your backup. Let's now walk through three incredibly simple methods for resetting an unavailable iPhone. If you're looking for a quick and easy way to reset your unavailable iPhone, look no further than the Erase iPhone feature. No need for a computer, no need for any fancy tools or software. Just your iPhone in hand, and you can reset it with ease. However, you can't take this convenient approach unless certain conditions are met. First, make sure your iPhone has been updated to iOS 15.2 or later. It also should have a stable network connection, too. And you need to know your Apple ID and password to log out for the reset. If all these requirements are fulfilled, you are ready to reset your unavailable iPhone in this way. After entering wrong passcodes to your iPhone for a few times, you can see the Erase iPhone option on the bottom right of the security lockout screen. Tap it. Tap it again to confirm the reset. Now enter your Apple ID password and tap Go on the lower right. Then the reset will start automatically. It'll be done after a few minutes. Just wait patiently. And when it finishes, you'll get an unlocked iPhone like it's whole brand new. You can start it all over again, or use your recent backup to recover the data. Probably you've used Find My to track and locate your lost iOS device. But do you know you can also use it to reset an unavailable iPhone? Here we'll show you how to do it by this means. Like the Erase iPhone feature, there are several things you should be aware of beforehand. Firstly, you should get your Apple account details in hand, and make sure that both the Find My iPhone option and network connection are enabled in your unavailable iPhone. Otherwise, you'll fail to use Find My to reset the device. To begin, get another phone, or tablet, or computer. It can be of any brand. Open a browser and log into iCloud.com. Once signed in, scroll down to the box where you can see the Find My icon. Tap here, and later you'll get a map. It will show the locations of all your iOS devices. Tap all devices at the top. Select your unavailable iPhone. Tap Erase iPhone and a warning message will pop up. If you're sure to reset your iPhone, tap Erase to confirm. Then your iPhone will reset by itself. As long as it has enough power and connects to the internet stably, the reset will be done after a while. Once finished, you can decide whether to start it afresh or recover the data from your backup. No internet on your unavailable iPhone? Forgot your Apple ID password? Don't worry. Even if you can't use the methods we've introduced before, there's still an incredible option for you to reset your unavailable iPhone. That is iPhone Unlocker. It's an efficient passcode removal tool that can bypass different passcodes like lock screen passcode, screen time passcode, and Apple ID password. Want to try this brilliant program to troubleshoot the issue? Go to this website to download it. You can also copy the site address from the description below. Before resetting your unavailable iPhone with this tool, download and install it on your computer. After the installation, launch it on the desktop. Click the blue tab, wipe passcode, and hit start. Click this link, device is connected but not recognized. Then a page will show up with the guide of making your iPhone enter recovery mode. Take the steps on screen and your iPhone will be recognized by the program. Now you'll reach a page where you need to confirm your device information. Select accordingly and click start to go on. A firmware package will then begin to download. Give it some time to complete. Once it's done, enter 0000 in the blank and hit unlock. The reset on your unavailable iPhone will be triggered then. When the progress bar gets to its end, that means the reset is over. Now you can set up the iPhone from scratch or restore the data using your backup. Well, that's all for today's video. If you have any questions, feel free to make comments below. And please hit the like button and subscribe to us for more latest videos. Thanks.